Okay, in this video, I'm gonna show you how to create some sub users over local users in your Dell SonicWall firewall appliance. Uh, sometimes you might need to do this because you know you have another IT guy that says, hey, can I have some access to the firewall to approve things on the whitelist or create some new rules or you know whatever. Or you just wanna create another user just to have as a backup account in case your main admin account gets locked up. So the first thing you wanna do is go to, to manage. And before we create some users, we need to check a particular setting before we create that new local user. So before we do that, let's go to network, go to interfaces, go to LAN and hit configure. We need to enable this option or the local user we create won't be able to log in. So it's very important. So once you enter that interface, go to the user login, hit HTTPS and hit okay. Now, if you want that local user to also access it externally, you're going to want to edit the WAN interface as well and enable that option too. But uh, fortunate enough for me, this local user only needs local access once they're on the same network as the firewall. So I'm not going to give external access just for security reasons. So once that setting saved, it's going to refresh, go to now we can go to users and go to local users and groups, go to add, and then we're going to go ahead and type in our user name, which is going to be just IGN test. And then I have a generated password that I'm just going to paste in there. Now you can set up an email if you have this all set up with the firewall to get receive, uh, you know, basically two factor authentication one time pass method, you can enable that if you want to, but we're not. So we're just like I said, this is just for testing, we're going to now go to groups because we need to give him some kind of access to the firewall. You can just give him VPN access, uh, guest administration, limited administration. Uh, we're going to go ahead and do SonicWall at the administrator group because we want him to have access to everything. So that will now keep in mind, that's pretty much full access, just like admin. So then there's other tabs here. We're not going to really dive in too much, but like this is for if you're just creating users just needs a VPN access. That's that tab and just other things that you might need. So that's all we are going to set up. We're just basically set up another admin account. So we hit OK on this page now and it's going to refresh and you can see now that account has been created. Now to test this to make sure it works and we can log in. Let's go ahead and hit log out, log back in. We're going to put in that user we just created and that password. Now, at first you're gonna be like, you know, what's going on here? Uh, it says I'm logged in, but you know, nothing else happens. What you have to do is when you get this pop-up, you have to make sure you allow pop-ups for this uh, local IP. You're gonna to wanna to click on manage here. And then once you click on manage, then you get redirected to the main admin page like you're used to. And from here, you can do anything what an admin can do. Now. Once you think you're all done, you just want to double check a couple of settings if, if things don't work. Go to uh, the manage tab, go to settings, and let's just make sure user authentication is set to local users. If you have Radius or LDAP or other things, you can connect to Active Directory if you want to. Um, but we're just, in this case, we're just doing local users. Um, you can enforce unique passwords, all these things here. I'm not going to dive too much into it, but you can see all the different options you have here. If we go back to local users, there was a couple things I wanted to point out. You can customize and add your own group if you want. Um, so you can do a lot of customization here with that Dell SonicWall administrator group when they log in if they have that particular group you know you get that pop-up and then you have to get the manage button where if you don't want that to pop up and you just want them to redirect to the main you know page just edit that group and there is a checkbox here I believe it's on an administration page yes it is you can select this where it says members go straight to the management UI on web login so if we hit okay on that then we should get directed right to that main page and you can see on the members tab you can see what members are on that group and you can see our IGN test is there so let's go ahead and hit okay and let's log out and log back in and see if that works so let's go back here we hit log out then we go log back in type in our username which is the ign test and then our password that we generated and it takes us right to our management page like we want to sometimes that pop-up is nice because it automatically logs them out after that you know 30 minutes of time but like i said that's your personal preference but sometimes it's nice just to get them right to the page that they want to get to well you guys that's it that's how you create a local user in a dell sonic wall firewall appliance very very easy. I hope this video was helpful and I'll see you guys in the next one.